go. And let's switch it now. Oh! <laughs> Where yeah, I was expecting a countdown. <laughs> Where did the transition go? I don't know what happened <laughs> to the transition. That would us a few seconds. Yeah, um, he was like, oh, Sorry. man, we're here. We're live. Hello. Oops. Hi. Um, I see there's a lot of people, 200 people watching. Uh, hi, bro, DB. You were first on Twitter. Laser Dragon. <laughs> Gaming Mysterio. Key and Prime. Yes, we're back. John Michael. Hello. Uh, I see Northern Star Dragons on Discord as well. Uh... Hi, David Godoy. Uh, what's up, Shashank7788? Hope everyone had a great E3 week. Yep, yeah, that's fun. I had a lot of fun at E3. Yeah, that's great. I saw Cyberpunk. Nice. I played Final Fantasy VII Remake. Awesome. I played Luigi's Mansion 3 and Leaks Awakening and Marvel Ultimate Alliance 3. I saw The Avengers. Jeez. Uh, that's a lot. It was. I saw Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Oh, you got to see that? I got to see that. How was that? It's, I want to see that. It's I'm very controversial is what it is. <laughs> I'm excited about that. I mean, I'm excited about a lot of those things. We got I'm yeah. pretty excited about the new Modern Warfare. Yeah, no, it was it was very good. It was the most into, like, a Modern Warfare uh, demo, or, like, even just a Call of Duty demo I've probably been into in some time. Nice. It's very intense. That's good. That's um, I was, like, on the edge of my seat. Lewis Gillis, what's up? Uh, Magic of the Sushi. Uh, Sith Gaming says loves the Spyro figure behind us. Yeah, I think that's first for figures or gaming heads or something. I'm pretty sure first for figures and gaming heads are the same company, ultimately, mm -hmm. anyway. But Remaster Resistance is here. That's crazy. Yeah, that's weird. Um, Lewis Gillis says he's very excited for Modern Warfare. Yeah, me too. After seeing it, it's really cool. Uh, John Michael says we're breathtaking, except <laughs> Corey. Yeah, Corey's not here. Um,. I don't know where he's at. Uh, was I in the crowd at E3? I was in the crowd at E3. I didn't go to any of the briefings. This is actually the first year. I don't remember the last time I didn't go to a press briefing. I, see, yeah, you... I did not go to any of them this year. Hmm. Uh, my girlfriend's parents were in town. They came oh, into yeah. town like last minute. Yeah. And I had to meet them. I'd never met them. And it was that Sunday. So it was like, instead of going to the Xbox briefing or the Bethesda briefing, that's what I did. Mm -hmm. You, you probably had access, though. You could probably win. Oh, I could I have. You could have. I could have. I could have. No problem. That's good. Yeah. Uh, Keanu was not at the Cyberpunk demo. He was just at the press conference. Matthew Hill Fitzsimmons says, what is up? What is my favorite E3? I don't know. It's hard to top, like, the early ones. They were so crazy back in the day. They love the Spider-Man pillow. Yeah, these are made for an event, and we've kept them yep. here. They're great. Um, David Goodeye says, Cyberpunk is my favorite. Yeah, Cyberpunk looks a lot of fun. Uh, Lewis Gillis asks, is this our first time playing Outer Wilds? Yes. And Justin's going to play. Okay. Yes, uh, I am. I'm going to play. Yeah, we're going we'll to even here. get started with Outer Wilds, and Justin's we going to hold the controller. Because I'm still eating lunch. Yeah. Because I was slow today. So we're going to play the Outer Wilds. Oh, yeah. As I understand it, you have 22 minutes before the world explodes. Yeah, so supposedly. kind of Majora's Mask. Yeah. Oh, we can't do the transition. Mm. No, I don't know. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> I guess I was quick enough. Uh, yeah, so this is our first time playing. Yes, first time I, playing. I think North Carolina played it. Let's see how this goes. We have not played it. Sinking data. Oh, okay. Oh. Mm. New? Well, yeah, North Carolina must not, have played it. No, we're just new. Just new. Let's see how this goes. Delete all the progress. Yeah, sure. Yep, I think so. Uh, Lewis Gillis says he's missed a lot of streams, but good to be back. It's good to have you back. Uh, is that it? Oh, you gotta move it. It's an A. Or no, it's a start, actually. Oh, that's clear. I can't see that. Mm -hmm. You can't go wrong with Doritos. I had to fish these out of the pantry, but worth it. Oh, yeah, those are, those are some special ones to get. They'll just yeah. disappear when you refill the Doritos. Did you see that they brought out new Coke again? No. Coke released new Coke again as part of a promotion for Stranger Things Season oh. 3. So anyway, we have a couple cans of new Coke on the way. Oh, really? Hopefully they'll arrive before we have to tear down the stream room, <laughs> and we can do a taste test, like a blind taste test of Coke versus new Coke versus maybe Pepsi. Oh, that's, that's I think it might cool. be fun to do Coke versus new Coke versus, like, Pepsi throwback. Yeah. Oh, it looks like you need to wake up. Oh. Okay. Here we go. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Whoa. Like a, I'm an alien? I don't know. But, chat, feel free to help us. There's our pilot. Mm, you're sleeping. Um, 
You're sure you fixed the retro rock? Yeah, probably. Oh, wow. See, I'm, I'm guessing if I do this, it's gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna first get my first death or something. Let's just see what happens. Oh, oh, I guess I can't on top yet. At Marvel says it's funny how most people now know his insomnia because the people who created Spider Man and not the people who created Ratchet and Clank anymore. <laughs> At least most people. Well, Spider Man is our most successful video game of all time, so I guess. Uh, This is a very Dagwood sandwich. Have you been to Dagwoods, James? Mm-hmm. Do you it's like good. Dagwoods? Mm-hmm. There's one across like where I live and I just haven't been there too much. Wait, there's one in Santa Monica? Yeah, there's Dagwoods. Like right across the street, like kinda of where I live. Huh. Like literally like I'm thirty seconds away. It's bad to know. <laughs> I shouldn't know this. Yeah, it's on Wilshire. You know Dagwood. You know what Dagwood is, though, right? No. He's a cartoon character. Oh. He always made gigantic sandwiches. Oh, I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. No, I'm trying to think what. I'm trying to think what cartoon that was. Uh, remaster. We don't know what it's like, but apparently we have only 22 minutes before okay. the, something destroys us and. Oh. Oh. Uh, oh. <laughs> Well, you can reset with the B wait, button, apparently. Okay, wait a second. Oh, I'm not supposed to. I think this is just to teach me how to fly a ship. Oh, I see how if you crash it, you're in trouble. This is really tricky. Can you can you fly it? Okay, down. There you go. Oh, I was pressing them both at the same time. Mm. That's why I was stupid. There you go. You're getting it. Until that happens. Um, he and I am I, that hungry right now. Anyways, let's keep going. I was hungry before I went to the gym and worked out, and I was starving after. Uh, is LaCroix still a favorite of at the studio? Yeah, we go through a lot of LaCroix here, but Eugene just put some coconut LaCroix out, and coconut is the most superior form of LaCroix. Well, well, well. Sorry. Sorry. Um, Game going to overtime today? No. The line for the shower was just freaking. Oh, let me okay. start over here. Mm. Oh, Doritos. Mm hmm. The line for the shower was mm, maybe seven people in front of me, which never happens. Oh. Sith Gaming switched to Mixer to watch because he's lonely on Twitter. Yeah, we have chat on all the different. I've got a bunch of people chatting on YouTube, some people on Twitch. I should have got a drink before I came in here. Yeah, probably. How's uh, this game? Hey everybody. We don't know what's going on yeah, yet. I'm still trying to Justin's figure this out. I'm not trying to make it too boring right now. <laughs> Isn't this the game where like you have a certain amount of time and then it resets? Or is that something else? Yeah, that's yeah. correct. I think you have like 22 minutes. Yeah, that's what we read. Oh, is this a furry? No one's told me like no, that they're 22 aliens. minutes yeah. yet. All I know is I need to like get the ship launched off. Mm, the so on this so alien planet, the optometrists would get a lot of work. They'd actually get paid double what optometrists on Earth make. Mm-hmm. You gotta measure four eyes. And it looks like the smaller, yeah. the, the eyes are probably different too. The top eyes probably need different measurements than the bottom eyes. I wonder if one's like long distance and others like up close. You know, sort of like bifocal eyes. How the hell do they oh, do that 3D that. movies? <laughs> With four glasses? Yeah, you gotta wear two sets. And four. And four. Hey, okay. people. Uh, Corey being half a man. No, I'm not half a man, I'm a shell of a man. There's a difference. John Manatee says the 22 minute thing doesn't happen until we leave the opening area. Oh. Hey, 8-Bit Butts. Oh, we saw you in real life. I'm doing something. 8-Bit Butts was at our community event. I didn't mm -hmm. see frequency. I'm tired. I was playing Frisbee at lunch, and I usually can come back in time for the stream, but then at the gym, there's just crazy line. Yeah, we don't have enough showers for your Frisbee game. Well, yeah, just a lot of circumstances. Didn't go too well. Plus, you have all the other... Like lunch workout warriors? It's usually fine. I usually come here like right on time or maybe like a minute late on Wednesday. Mm hmm. Today was just. I saw right when I got in the gym. I was like, oh, there's no chance. <laughs> What's that big blue square? I don't know. No, that was weird. I'm trying to use this. Oh, is it just an indie game thing? I'm trying to like find this person. Uh, Remaster said this is an episode of Two and a Half Men. Corey's the half man. 
Yeah, Justin's a man and a half. Corey and I are both half men. Nah, I'm a shell. I'm a shovel man. Mm. It's a difference. Also known as a shadow of my former self. AMP Marvel asks if the Captain Cork statue behind me is available for sale online. Um, you can occasionally find them on eBay. They were employee-only vinyls. So, relatively rare. Hey, Big Butts, you looked fine. All good. Okay, so I'm supposed to hide and seek. I see the person. I'm so blind right now. Can I well, it's tough because of the darkness. I think you can make a jump there. Oh my uh, god. I clicked A. Okay, well, maybe I should just stop. Wait, no. I don't need to do this, I don't think. Well, maybe it's to teach me something. Like Kim Prime wants some, oh. us to tell him the news. I don't know what news. So we have a new what? Oh. Yeah, that light was off. It was off, but now it's on. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, it's doing that shit again? The one on no, the it's a different one, though. It was one of the front ones before, I think. Um, Gaming Mysterio, do we have a new video game we're working on? Yeah, it's called Stormland. It's coming out for the Oculus Rift. Stormland. You can check out trailers and stuff online. My uncle was asking me, hey, how do you save Netflix movies onto a DVD? And I was like, that's called piracy and you can't do it. <laughs> like, he thought that there's some way that us youngins just download Netflix onto a disc and take it with us. I mean, you do, but, like, onto an iPad. Yeah, you want, he wanted to, like, make copies. Yeah, no. Yeah. Do you want to sell them? He has stupid amounts of money from like the government pension. He mm -hmm. was he was an electrician mm -hmm. uh, for the state, mm -hmm. and he lives in San Francisco. And he had his uh, steps. They had to like remodel them to upgrade the building code of how the steps ha have to be for your houses in San Francisco. Mm -hmm. And it was like eighty thousand mm. dollars to redo his fucking steps. Wow. And he's like, yeah, whatever. And his wife is a. Uh, retired government worker, but she still gets her full salary from her pension, even mm. though she doesn't work anymore. Mm -hmm. It's ridiculous. <clears throat> Life's not like that anymore for us. All right, I just need to do this 22 minute. Cool guy wants to know if there's gonna be another Ratchet and Clank in the future. And that is up to PlayStation, because they own Ratchet and Clank. We don't, we just make it. Will there be another Ratchet and Clank future in the past? No. The pass is already written. We'd have to get a time chain and really mess with some stuff to put a Ratchet & Clank feature in the past. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Hey, Noble. Ready for the real deal. Wow, we have some viewers today. Mm-hmm. Okay, so we're gonna go down into the cave. How do you catch an annoying fly? Uh, with honey. Do you want to catch the fly? Have you seen those, like, those, what are they, little, like, sand guns or something? You like, really shoot the insects? Yeah. Those things look, look pretty cool. That'd be useful. So they shoot your eye out. Yeah. Mm. Oh, um, you can turn on a flashlight. There you go. Okay. That'd have been useful when you were trying to jump where you. The oh yeah. I'll yeah. say the flashlight in Days Gone looks a little better than this. Well, it's an indie game versus you know game. No. <laughs> suit up. Okay, I got my space suit now. Okay. Okay. Oh. Cool. Gotta watch your fuel. Okay. Getting some zero chain. Guess what? Give me the dirt. Yeah, Kim, but if you use honey, then it'll get stuck. What's the favorite game you guys have developed or released at the moment? Hmm. I mean, Spider Man is great. I really liked working on Ratchet and Clank Future Crack in Time. Sunset Overdrive is also a lot of fun. 
liked Ratchet PS4. No, it was good too. Yeah. Zarkin asks, now that Spire is coming to Crash Team Racing, can we challenge Naughty Dog to a tournament? I suppose. No, no, can I go up? I know that they had Crash in um, Uncharted 4. Mm -hmm. But in general, like, I feel like they're kind of over that stuff. Wait, wait, what? Press the button. Well, oh. Activision. Um, yeah. Activision does own Crash yeah. and Spyro, so. Yeah. Um, that's cool. On your next stream, we should play Close to the Sun. Okay. Oh, nice work. Okay. Yeah, sorry, 8 bit butts. I know I owe you a response. Just been busy couple days since getting back from E3. And by busy, I mean I was basically dead on Monday. He was. He was pronounced dead at the scene, and Justin had to give him mouth to mouth and resuscitate him. I was going to say, it was thanks to a kiss from Justin. It was beautiful. It was like Snow White. Came right back to life. Was that the one and a half men thing? <laughs> All right. Uh, E3 is cool. It's kind of different this year. Spread out. Microsoft was in a completely separate building. Sony wasn't there at all. Uh, yeah, I never, I never went to the Microsoft thing. I wanted to go in, and the line was huge, and I was like, uh, yeah. Uh. yeah. Okay. Couldn't, couldn't I, bother. I gotta have to get a snack. I'm dying here. Sorry, guys. I'll be right back. Suppose I'm eating in front of you, huh? Yeah. The story would have been fine, but when I'm sitting here like eating chips, and he's like, God, <laughs> this is crap. Okay. Um, there should be one more. It's thing. on the inside, right? Oh, it's probably right. Probably right. I know. Don't you run out of jet fuel, dude. No, no, the inside of that thing. Turn around. Sorry. On the inside of that, pretty sure. Flashlight's on. So. There you go. Oh. Right? Yeah, it should be like one. Or is it around the edge? It'll give me like a little cursor thing. Like. Can you not go in? I Couldn't you see, didn't you see inside of it? Like if you go up to the very top and look down? Maybe I'm wrong. I thought I saw you, like at one point you were up here and looking down. There you go. Nice. Alright, crossing. Oh, that'll be true. I'll be running out of juice. Uh, oh, that's true. I need to get out. I saw what BCD? Avengers BCD? Yeah, I saw the Avengers BCD. Um, yeah, no. E3 between like going to the show floor and seeing tons of people and talking to tons of people and. Um, yeah, it's exhausting. Justin, not sure we're gonna let you fly the zero G suit anymore. <laughs> I, I'm just trying to figure out where to go. It's hard to see. I yeah, got, ditch. I got everything fixed, but okay. So Macasio says greetings from Germany. Ooh. I'm gonna assume Germany. They mean Germany. They're really big fans of Avid Asselhoff there. there. All right. Mm. Cool. All right. Simulation. I think you should have picked someone with G letters. Like, well, he forgot the G, so like, I'm taking off the first letter from Like, me. Linda Ertrude or something. Mm. Yeah, can't undo it. Or I, Thomas. I, Thomas, that like I, Robot? Mm, yeah, so exactly. So I fixed it. Should I just leave now? What do you think of the Keanu reveal? Here's my thing. Well, let me finish chewing first. Give me the dirt. Okay, so Keanu Reeves. I'm old enough to remember that the public used to be very annoyed by Keanu Reeves in the 90s, before the Matrix. They thought he was like this teen heartthrob who was terrible at acting. 
like awful, awful at acting, and he did a shit job, and movies he was in, it was really annoying. He did these like fake British accents in uh, the vampire movies, and it was like notoriously awful. And then he did Bill and Ted, and he got typecast as that. And then uh, Point Break, and everyone was like, oh, dude, oh, whoa, Keanu, oh. And everyone was like, that guy's stupid. I love Point Break, though, and Speed. Then he did The Matrix, and kind of embraced that, like, whoa thing. And mm. But it was so good. Go to the observatory. And then time went on, and people were like, yeah, Keanu's really cool. And... Um, I'm very happy for him that he's so beloved now and he's like this big icon. He's always been kind of a quiet guy. Um, I'm sure the observatory is that big building with the dome on it. So, anyway, that's my thoughts. Oh, you're correct, James. I know. The observatory. Hmm. Alright, let's see what happens. Let's go to this 22 minute thing so you guys can try to... But from everything I hear about Keanu, he's a really cool guy. So it's cool that he's in cyberpunk. Hmm. It's very nice. Oh. Oh wait. Hey, where's um? Same phone. Who dish? Is he here? No, I haven't seen him. I wanted to make fun of him. Well, some of you guys are from Europe, right? Remaster Resistance, you're like Irish or something, right? Uh, he's Irish, that's right. Yeah. No, maybe he's Welsh. Because um, same phone who dish was always asking us, especially Justin, like camera questions and stuff. So I wanted to ask him, since he's British. Actually, I think Remaster is Northern Irish. Oh, really? I don't know. Not from Ireland, it's from North Ireland. It's barely, barely European at all, honestly. Mm. Well, I was going to comment on how they, they pronounce the cameras differently there than they do here. Uh huh. So here, you know, Justin and I would be talking and be like, oh yeah, I'm going to shoot on the Sony <laughs> here. On the, uh... Key and Prime. Oh, you're Irish too? Right. Mm. You should hang out with Remaster since you both live in Ireland. Yeah. So um, they're like, oh, I'm gonna shoot out Sony or Canon or Nikon or something, and but then in England they're like, and maybe Ireland too, they're like, so you guys shoot on the Nikon or the Fuji? Hmm. I was shooting with Fuji in Japan, and my favorite there was a time where like these Japanese guys stopped, or these Japanese like older Japanese guys mm -hmm. were taking a picture of like one of the nicest trees like in the Osaka Park, and they were like. And I was taking a picture of them, and they're like, "Oh, we'll take a picture of you." And like, the picture, and they like handed, they hand the camera, like, "Oh, Japanese camera, very good." And I was like, "Yeah." Got up, Fuji on number one. That was great. It was awesome. They were cute. They invited us to like have Hakami, Hanami with them, which is like the picnic during that season. So like, and but then they were like, "Oh, here's a fish sausage, a cold fish sausage, which is like a hot dog, but it's made of fish." <laughs> and it's cold, and it's more gelatinous than a hot dog. Oh, that's and they're like, here, here, eat this, eat that's this. That's like tofu. I'm like, we'll share one, we'll share one. No, nope, we both mm. got one, and we both had to eat a full fish mm. to be polite, and it was um, pretty gross. <laughs> pretty gross. Let me tell you, they did give us booze and some pocky and stuff too, mm. so like it wasn't a total loss. But holy moly, it was like, oh man, I gotta eat this whole long. It was like this too. It was like this. Mm. <laughs> Okay. No, that guy got three eyes. Can you give me the fate of my destiny now? Uh, Zarkirn. Sorry if I'm saying that wrong. Zarkirn? Kirin? Oh, okay. right. Does not like having um, the celebrity likeness okay. of uh, characters in games. So then you must be not looking forward to Death Stranding. Uh, yeah. Two Star Gamer said that it's crazy the Matrix almost got scrapped, but Keanu funded out a bunch with his own money and saved it. I didn't know that. Mm. I just remember when the Matrix came out, it was like, oh my goodness. Game changer. No. Yep. Total game changer. No. Yep. Unfortunately, game changer for the worst. It was such a cool movie and I loved it. 
but the way that it changed the style of action, mm. almost everything that came after it was worse than the things that came before it mm. in terms of action. Because it's like an action sci-fi movie. Right. But very much an action movie. Great action. And a lot of like kung fu. But what's so brilliant about it, it's not just random kung fu. It's There's a reason in the plot for why they do those types of fights. And there's a reason in the plot for all the bullet time, the right. slow-mo and the acrobatics and stuff. It's all like built into the story for why this is possible. And then all these movies came out afterwards. They were like, oh, let's just copy that style and have no reason for it. And it's just nonsense. Right. And it went so far in that direction that now they don't know how to do real action anymore. Well, Mad Max is like the only good one that came out recently. You're so harsh. John Wick is cool, but it does all this ridiculous stuff that is like impossible. Oh, I'm just gonna crash this into like. Yeah, you want me to fly it? Yeah, you're good, James. Are you ready? Uh, we got the no. goddess off the. Go find a planet. They can go to any planet. Yeah, um, go. Oh, that's just a camera. David, we don't care about Mortal Kombat being too violent or morbid. Um, we would stream it. We could only not stream it during our charity month when we're doing Play Live, because that's uh, like for kids. But that's over now. So we can play mature rated games. Ooh, well, you, you can uh, I don't know when we do it, but we have a lot of Mortal Kombat fans in the office. We could probably like get a couple of them rounded up. And Where should I go to, everybody? You can match the velocity too, James. Yeah, where should um, we go, everybody? Oh. Uranus. <laughs> well, they're naming them different, Corey. <laughs> You can find the one that oh. looks like that. <laughs> Man, Key and Prime writing a tale of two cities here in the chat. Yeah, yeah I don't even want to read it. <laughs> I'm talking about face What's happened? There was a problem with Mad Max. The rights are all messed up, so they're not making any more. So sad, man. Yeah. It's fine. So well done. It's fine. Just make something different. Like, I, I feel sequels like he was all, on a roll, though. I feel like he could have done it, right? He could have done, like... With the trilogy, do you think you could have made it work? Like seeing like the thunder, like the number two and number three or something? <laughs> Maybe you're right. Maybe. Maybe he why not just make something new? He could just just make something new. It's true. He's getting old too, George. Yeah, and he, there's all this controversy where like he gave his wife all the credit for editing the movie, but it was really like she doesn't know how to use the program, and and there's like two guys who like oh just God. got sacked. I hated that. A big that, controversy. They did like, all this work, and they didn't get the credit, and she got yeah. the Academy Award and everything. And it's like, or, or the nomination at least, and it's like, what the hell? So that kind of soured it for me, where I was like, oh, I love the movie, but that it just it makes me feel bad about the making of it. Mm -hmm. So I'm kind of like, eh. Yeah, you see that? See that landing? That was good. WB and George Miller in a legal battle. Yeah, George Miller is like really hard to deal with, from what I understand. So what are we doing out here? You have 22 minutes to gather info. Yeah, but... Oh, uh, I think it picks up, like, signals. Yeah, I like that. Oh, you have boosters, too, I think, Jane. No? Uh, Bucket oh, Animator is sure. trying triggers, to chat in the stream, but apparently has not been following Insomniac long enough. I don't know what that means. I can see your message. You're on Discord. Oh yeah, but we're we're, we're looking at restream, so we see everything from Discord and from Twitch and YouTube. So like, you might not see the comments we're responding to if it's like a YouTube comment, for example. Right. That's Tim's genius right there. Does this game have weapons? What do you have? That's not a weapon that you have. It's some little like radar gun. Oh, that's a satellite. I don't yeah, know what I'm doing. Right. I have no idea what we're supposed to do. No one's really told me to just like explore the universe. Well, where are you trying, Bucket Animator? Where are you trying to chat? We'll we'll fix it. How smart is Tim? Tim's IQ is 137. It's in the top five percentile of human beings. Bucket animator want to say something about using actors' faces and being used in production. Oh, well, that was um, I think remaster resistance was the one that was talking about that stuff. 
Or no, it was Keem Prime. It was Keem. Keem Prime. Okay, well. Man, this planet sucks. Yeah, I don't like this planet. I feel like we didn't go to the right place. Alright, let's look at the map again. Is that the Millennium Falcon? I know, what, what was that? Oh, wait, are we on the moon? Is that why? We're Maybe. just on the moon. Yeah, I think we're just on a moon. Right? Or are you on this one? Oh, someone went there. Bucket Animator is on Discord. We're seeing the Discord messages. Okay, so let's try and go to that planet. Oh, John is saying you should look for landmarks to investigate before you land. Uh, that makes sense, too. Considering how big the planets seem to be. Alright. Here we go. Okay, so where are we going? We're going to the... There's a gas giant somewhere? Yes. Yeah, That's the sun, though, right? We yeah. don't want to go to the there sun. There was this kid in high school we used to call gas giant. Yeah? Yeah. Oh! oh. <laughs> You're dead. You're dead, aren't you? <laughs> it just, like, evaporated. What was that? What... I don't know. I I did get Chungus on PS4. Got the uh, deluxe edition. Oh wait. It, uh, uh, I got time up. I have a chili relleno that I'm gonna eat after the stream. I'm looking forward to that. Mm. It takes like six minutes to heat up. I couldn't do it before the show. Mm. Yeah. Well, you know. Appreciate that. You need some food. I heard your stomach growling. Oh, you got the launch code still. Okay. You just, you just yeah, so we can just <laughs> go straight to space this time. Uh, this is not Fortnite. Sorry. It is nighttime, though, and, and he is in a fort. Bucket animator said the moment is past. It's a bummer. Hate it when the moment passes. That's the thing about the present. It's not really even a thing. There's the past and the future. You can't even measure the present. When I started talking about it, that's the past now. Oh, I see, this tells me where my... Okay, so then there's a map, okay, yeah. So do we wanna try and get to the interloper? Oh. Kim Prime says they use Troy Baker's face for the main character oh, in Advanced giants. Warfare. Many giants keep? Oh, there you go, now you got, now you got a cursor. Zarkiern is talking about stuff with the actors and if something happens to the actor, how does that change their representation in the game and the consequences of it and Yeah, I'll let you guys talk about that. Uh they wanna know if this game's better than Fortnite. <laughs> well, it's definitely uh not as battle royale. -y. Hey Parker. Uh, this game is called uh, what is this? No, no Outer Man's Sky. Oh, Outer Worlds. Outer Worlds. <laughs> Outer Worlds. Is that a joke? Yeah. Well, I was half serious. I mean, it's kind of kind of similar, right? If time stops, is that the present? Yeah, that would be how you could measure the present, but otherwise the present is just like, gone. You type that comment, it's in the past. Oh! Wait. <laughs> Wait. It's okay, it's a water planet, you're fine. Oh, what the oh man, go go meet Jar Jar and that, that, what is his name? I just like, it was like all of a sudden, it was like, oh man, we're coming in hot, but fortunately <laughs> oh, yeah. it was the atmosphere and the clouds. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, can you go see, um, what's that guy that, that you know, he goes in Phantom Menace. Come meet that guy. Uh, oh, what is this? Bill this Paxton Tornadoes. Dude, this is wild. It's a Category 5 Sandorthian. What's it called? Van Dinosaur the G or something? That he thing. knows it. Uh, he just won't say it. Gang, huh? Gang, 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 gang. <laughs> the dude that runs the underwater city in. Boss Nass. Yeah, Boss Nass. Yeah. 
<laughs> you have a life that to this? Yeah. <laughs> Be gone with him! Ooh. Parker loves our work. Oh, thank you. Crack the cockpit. Oops. Parker, you probably just love our work because we, we worked on something called Peter Parker. Hey, Anastasia. What's up, Anastasia? Ebony Logic. This is sort of like No Man's Sky. Uh, it's a little different. There's like a timer. You're trying to like complete a goal. Whoa, 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 whoa. But there's like planet what exploration and stuff. It's dead? neat. Did I just get killed? I guess. Oh, man. Just keep... This is hard. This is... Like, I, I apparently I touched something got me killed. Rough. I wouldn't call it, like, No Man's Sky. I mean, like, it, like yes, there's planets you fly between, but that's, like, a giant procedural universe where this actually has, like, a story to it and is crafted and designed in... So, mm. you know. Uh, General Kenobi. Or, as our friend would say, Enril Kenobi. Have we played Observation? No. Oh, Lewis is here too. Hey, Lewis. Lewis Gillis. You bought the Spider-Man Council, or console, <laughs> Council. Well, thanks, Parker. It's a rare console these days. Mm -hmm. Hard to find. Oh, I see. That's how you roll the ship. Oh. oh. Okay, that's handy. Huh. All right. So we want to go after the interloper this time. Yeah, I guess so. Let's try that one. I don't know what we're doing. Kian Prime says he enjoys looking at your pictures on Instagram, Corey. Yeah, I wish Corey could edit all of my photos because he knows what he's doing apparently in uh, Lightroom. Well, I mean, I'm not saying your compositions and your photography itself isn't good. But I, yeah, I gotta say though, so yeah, like a month ago or so, I decided to kind of get back into Instagram and like post my landscape photos that I do. Um, and I was saving my good photos until now. I was posting all my old stuff from other trips, but then I went to the Italian Alps last summer and that's like the best, most beautiful place I've ever seen. And I took a lot of photos of it with my new camera. So I was starting to put them up this week and I'm like three or four photos in and the reception is like crickets. Dead in the water, just dead on arrival. I put out this gem that's like way better than the photo I posted last week or two weeks ago. And it's just like nothing, like five likes. And Thomas is posting pictures of his freaking face. Like he does the little <laughs> selfie thing like this. And he does it like over and over and over. And he's like, wow, I'm at a wedding. Wow, I'm on an airplane. Oh, wow, I'm at E3. And just a freaking close up of his face and it gets us more likes. And I'm like, well, that's funny. I mean, I like that. I'm not knocking what he's doing. <laughs> I'm just saying that this is a carefully crafted landscape photo that a lot of time and effort and energy and skill has gone into it. Uh -huh. And it's just making your, you're saying that you're nobody skill. gives a shit. It's like, I am a total failure at, you know, uh, gaining some sort of following. Well, are you using hashtags? Yeah. Are you following other people and commenting on their photos? Yeah. So you're just like randomly looking through finding other people's photos and actually commenting on them. Like, Engaging with them trying to get them to follow you. Yeah, and you're not getting any likes Are you going to places where there are as crazy food and uh, People in weird clothing and lots of fun rainbow wow. colors No, I have 27 likes here on this photo. Look at this. Is this a 27 like photo? Give me a freaking break know, depends man. Depends on you're following is if no one follows you or anything. No, nobody it. follows me, but I mean like My garbage look at this 118 likes on this thing. This is a piece of crap photo. And then this one, 
27 likes, this is my best work I ever did. What the hell? <laughs> I mean, look at this. Like, it's freaking flawless. And then it's like, oh, you want to see what it looks like from front? That's, like... <sighs> this is hard to land on, dudes. Yeah. Wait, are you trying to match the velocity? Yeah, yeah, I am. It's and just, it's, it's, it's moving very fast. Shit. That's weird. Uh, and it's, uh... I found the recommended path. I mean, it says you can do it all, but yeah, interlooper first. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, it says Addle Rock practice landing, but you're fine. You can land. And then interlooper is the next to play, so... Th this should be your... Next place. And then, yeah. That place we went to is, like, ten on this list. Oh, like, really? Yeah, so maybe so we, we went to the something. wrong place. Yeah, it's it, this is a recommended path, though. You can do anything, I guess. It's not saying you have to do this, but I guess... Yeah, that's right. Look, I just landed on it. Nice. I have this one guy named uh, Caleb who is like a good pro photographer from Utah, and he posts all these cool Utah photos and stuff. He comments on my stuff, and like he keeps me going because he's better than me, and I see his photos, and I'm like, oh, that's cool. Like Maybe if I keep practicing, I'll get to be as good as him. And the reason he started following me is because we were both at Mount Whitney at the same time, and so we were both doing Mount Whitney photos, and we, we like Looking saw at location. Yeah, we saw each other's photos and started commenting on them, and then, but he's way better than me. But he still looks at my photos and like gives me words of encouragement. But um, is that like when you told me that you like my composition, you're way better than me, but you were giving me words of encouragement? But you did a good photo. Like that's the thing. It's like I, I like put way more time into taking photos than you do. But when you take a good photo, I see him like, oh, hey, you did a good job. That's an awesome photo, you know? It's not like, uh... So what you're saying is you try, and he's giving you words of encouragement because he knows you're trying. Yeah, and he's good, and he can, like... Yeah. I don't know. It's. I just... I felt like there would be... Um, the more that I post... And the better my photos get, that there would be like a gradual ramp. I wasn't expecting overnight success. <laughs> but I thought that gradually over time... How many times do you post in a day? Once a day. Okay, that's right. Are and you... I'm losing followers. I've been I've lost about 20 followers in the last 10 days. And I haven't gained any. And I've been posting photos in the Alps. Well... Key and Prime saw that I just responded to that guy, Caleb. Yeah, because I just saw that Caleb. I was playing Frisbee earlier. I didn't see he commented, but... Um, I can't fall off this, can I? Oh, no. The great thing about photography is how easy it is to see self-improvement. Yeah, but the thing... That's what's frustrating is that I feel like the photos I'm posting now, which are more recent than the ones I posted earlier, are way better. And they are the culmination of all the skills I learned on my past trips. But I get more likes on my old shitty photos and my new photos, nobody cares. And I'm just like, I thought I was doing this right. I'm not. Is oh, there wait, a connection between Spider-Man and Avengers? Well, actually, the lore, the official lore, according to... Um, um, I don't know who, like, according to Thanos, they all got bit by a radioactive spider back in day one, before there were any superheroes. And um, then Tony Stark got bit by the same radioactive spider, and so did um, Silver Surfer and Wolverine. They all got bit by this radioactive spider, and then um, it was different legs of the spider had different powers, and so, like, one of them had turned into Iron Man, and the other one had turned into Wolverine. And so they're all connected like that. A bit butts says oh, uh, his been... Twitter blew up with shit posts more than well thought out tweets. <laughs> I gave up on Twitter. I can't. I can't handle Twitter. This may have been a bad decision. <laughs> You're like, like, wait a second. This is what I'm supposed to be landing on. I shouldn't be. I shouldn't be going too far away. I think I need to do something with this. Yeah, I think you do. I think you. you... Wow. Oh, Keem Prime said something nice. Thanks, Keem Prime. Keem Prime, I I would have followed you back, but I saw your account. It's just like selfies. I already got Thomas. I don't want it. I don't want my feed to be a bunch of oh, close-ups yeah, of somebody's you face. You know what I mean? I 
I follow, I like my whole feed is just like pictures of landscapes from all these pro landscape people that I follow, and then freaking Thomas's face, because Thomas always posts these shots of just like that, like, hey, I'm at E3, guys. Wait, Parker, did you have a question? Or what were you talking about? Will we play Crash on stream? Is, is there a new, like the Crash Racing game, the new one? I think he might have fallen that. Man, why do people ask about the proposal Easter egg? Obviously, not pleased with how that all went down. Like, poor dude, poor girl, I'm poor everyone involved. Last time we ever put proposal in a game, that's for sure. <laughs> the rumor board in your ship computer will update try tying things together. Oh. Crash Racing. Oh. Ebony Logic's asking if we're gonna play Crash Racing on stream. Is it is out now, isn't it? I think it is. I think it's very unlikely that we play that. Sorry. Really? Yeah. Yeah. I don't mean if I guess if you wanna play it, but but I like kart racers. I know. I remember the old crash racing on PlayStation 1. Wait, what does this mean? Dude, my uncle is still asking me. He says, well, how do you pirate the movies? I'm a man of standards. And I'm telling him, I'm busy at work. And then he's like, well, when are you coming to Vegas? <laughs> So wait, do we oh, are we done up. here? Do we have or do we have um, to go to? No, maybe just go somewhere else. I, so it says the goal is to find out what happened to the Nomai, and then solve the mystery of the time loop. So basically, okay, trying to get to the eye of questions. the universe, James. And once you reach it, you finish the game. And I guess you're uh, observing things on each of the planets. Yeah, but do I need to do anything else here? I'm not sure. I, I, it's not telling me like what each planet did. What what's there to do? But I know the next place. Oh wait. Interlooper, learn about the planet's phases. Discover the Nomai. Did you, did you learn? Uh, did all you? I've learned is that there's a frozen shuttle. Hmm. Um, wait. Remaster, what was your question that you asked? I just scrolled up. I didn't see any questions. I saw you talking about other stuff. And then um, Parker asked the question about, like, the tie-in of... Spider-Man with other stuff that I'm not really at liberty to speak about because I'm not an expert on all things Marvel. Wait, what, you, what was that question? Uh, the Parker question was is there a connection between Spider-Man and Avengers? Mm, well, I don't know. You have to ask Marvel games. Yeah, that's why I just we made just it. We just made Spider-Man. Yeah. Oh, you gotta get inside it, James. Is the Insomniac in Spider-Man game in the in same timeline as a Square Enix think. Avengers game? That's what they're asking. It says use the gravity. You gotta ask Marvel Games about use that. Use the gravity cannon. Wait, we don't have a gravity cannon. If you wish to get inside the frozen shuttle, you'll need to head head to the Ember. Oh. The n other planet. Another okay. planet. Yeah. Got it. That's what I thought. So I have, I have to go there and summon it home. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's see if there's anything. So else. that's all we needed to do here for now. I think so. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. I somehow slingshotted oh. myself off the surface. <laughs> oh. Oh. Wait. There is like. Wait. Hold on. Key and Prime, if you if you post slice of life stuff instead of just a close up of your face, I'll follow you. I just don't want my feed to be close ups of people's faces. It weirds me out. Is that just Key and Prime? It's just close up of his face. Yeah, I looked. I briefly so looked like at Thomas. his profile, and it's just yeah, exactly. I guess there is something you can do, James, but I, you can keep going. If you want. Wait, where am we going next? No. Uh, Ooh, well, Anastasia. Do you want to do keep doing stuff on this planet, or you want to go somewhere else? No, we're going to the Ember. Um. I got it. Never mind. Yes, you can go there. Even though it says Ember Twin is like fifteen down on this list of twenty things. Uh, John says that's a good call, and John sounds like uh, he knows what he said. Going to the Ember Twin. Uh, yeah. Well, on this thing, it doesn't say that, but okay. It's fine. Um, so Anastasia, I'm having a chili relleno after the stream. It's gonna be real tasty. I got it from Trader Joe's. I had some Trader Joe's tamales last night. Oh. That's pretty good. Yeah, those are good too. <laughs> the heck just happened? <laughs> I think this ship's launching. This ship kind of looks like a pirate oh, ship. Is it super ring? Is it over? Yeah, the world's ending, right? No? Oh, no. Oh, no, we got too close. To the sun? Yeah, I think oh. so. What are you, Icarus? Oh, you got pulled into by the gravity. The yeah, the gravity pulled us off the surface. That's hilarious. 
Hey. Man, I need glasses. Twitch Kev. Hey there. Anastasia's so hungry, all she can think about is food. Well, I'll grab a snack. Or chug some water, too. Okay, we've locked on. You don't have a snack twin. nearby. Uh, would you take 12 unknown don donuts or a 20-inch pizza with unknown toppings? If you had to pick, blindly. Are yeah. all the donuts the same, or is it like 12 different donuts that are unknown? Because then it's like at least probably a couple of them are going to be good. I used to eat both of those foods a lot, and now I don't really. Donuts and what? Pizza. Oh, I love pizza. I love pizza too, but I just can't eat it. Dude. I haven't been eating it much lately. Yeah, it's probably smart. It's better for you. Pizza's not good for it's you. It's really bad for you. Kev is saying this is like No Man's Sky, lol. I made that joke before, and they nailed me to the wall. This is different. I tried to say that, I nearly got fired. I feel like there's more of a point. This HR violation. At least there's more of like this story I like can't say. Ember Twin, is that like that band, Aphex Twin? Yes. Okay. It's kind of like how Insomniac Games is sort of like that band, a perfect circle. We are. They stole our logo. <laughs> this game oh, does seem oh, pretty cool. Hot. No, we're good, we're good. We're good, we're good. Okay. Is that a tennis ball? <laughs> it's going pretty quick. Uh, oh, you did it. Oh, James is going to get at this. Woo -hoo -hoo. Oh, Woo -hoo. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. All right. The writer on this game was also the writer on Stormland. Right? Wait, what? What? Stormland? Cool. We outsourced the writing for Stormland? We didn't just write it ourselves? I don't know. <laughs> These are questions. Like something that every day. What writing in Stormland? Well, there's lots of writing in Stormland. I mean, there's always text. Let me tell you about what writing. What? What the hell? <laughs> huh? That's so weird This to is me. awesome. These planets are sort of magical with the, like, the whole... This game looks really fun. What is this? This is a uh, Outer Wilds. We have this on Xbox Game Pass, though, huh? Uh huh. Is this on PlayStation? Uh, I don't know. I might buy it. I kind of want to play it. No. It seems to be fun just to kind of noodle around. I think it's on Xbox. Is it an Xbox exclusive? Uh. I don't have an Xbox though. Wait, let me look. Xbox and Windows. Anastasia's gonna bake cookies. You play on your PC. Anastasia, will you send me some cookies? One is a normal chocolate chip, and another one is a raspberry and white chocolate topping that I never tried before. Which should I bake first? Ooh, well... I'm assuming this is where I could make I would say get the raspberry and white chocolate topping first, because otherwise you might get cookie fatigue by the time you get that one. Just do it and see right off the bat. Try, it. try something new. Has anyone told you that you are breathtaking? Well, I'm short of breath because I was playing Frisbee earlier. No, no one has told me that. Oh, you're just quoting that Keanu thing from the yeah. press conference. I thought I was actually getting complimented for a second. Oh, oh what am I supposed to say? Oh, no, 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 no. This you're is... breathtaking. I mean, I think he played that off pretty well. Did I tell you I saw Rudy Gobert at E3? No. He's the center on the Utah Jazz and he's two time defensive player. Oh. Of the year. What happened? That's gotta wait. Yeah, I just I screwed up. Alright. Trying to find this writing thing. I don't even understand this. Boomer, I'm not gonna get an Xbox just for this game. I want it on PlayStation. Also, I've never owned an Xbox. My girlfriend has an Xbox, but I Really? Yeah. Hmm. She likes gears. It's weird. She likes to just sit there and just like chainsawing people and stuff. There's like, one or three. Does that make you worry? Like, does she actually own a real chainsaw? She says weird stuff sometimes. <laughs> yeah? Like, when she's cooking and she has the knife in her hand, like the big kitchen knife, I'm like, just, you know, just a real knife. Just... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, it's not, no I'm, just, I'm just kidding. She's, it's not like that. But but she, she um, 
likes super violent video games. That's all. Like she likes Doom a lot too. Uh, yeah, Easy Allies is good. Crash Team Racing comes out Friday. Okay. Oh, just like. Also, favorite celebrity cameo in a video game: Stan Lee in our video game. Another great part is gonna burn our. It's the end of the world already. How much of that can I take? <laughs> oh, I have four eyes. That's why I'm getting the four little thingies, right? The lens flares. Because I have four eyes. Mm-hmm. Uh -oh. <laughs> Did you kill yourself in the fire? Gone in 60 seconds. <laughs> I just wanted to see what would happen. In your free time, do you like playing the games you worked on? I played a bunch of Spider-Man at home. It was nice to play on my couch or my big screen, but I've taken dev kits home. Mm -hmm. I, don't know, I probably played through the game at home like four or five times before it came out at different points of development. So. What's happening? You're awake. You just woke up again. But we're almost out of time. Just go, go up the elevator. This one? Yep. Wow, Jeopardy was having 14 to 18 million viewers a day during Hulse Hours of Run. That's like 8% of the people that were protesting in Hong Kong. Oh, wow. That's a lot of people protesting in Hong Kong. Yeah. What were they protesting about? Uh, Jackie Chan's not returning for Rush Hour 4. Oh. How long do we play for? Just an hour. What now? What do I do? Uh, I the and key, uh, remaster, I don't keep a dev kit in my house. If I bring a dev kit, I bring it home, play, and then I take it back to work. That, that, that's the main reason. Like, I won't even bring it if I'm not... I won't even bring a dev kit home if I'm going to leave it. <laughs> no, wait. Or I keep it in my car the whole time, so I don't. <laughs> you just take off. I'm free, free falling. Wait, where oh. is this? I'm alive. Ship out. Where's I'm the alive. This ship oh. just fell next to oh. you. Oh. Oh, I thought I was in zero G. Boomer streams. You ever thought about releasing a game on PC? Well, you I should mean, try uh, the no, port of fine. Sunset like, Overdrive. This is good. Or you could play the game Slow Down Bowl. Or you could play any of our Oculus games, which are all on PC as well. <laughs> we can count it. <laughs> but Boomer Streams, if I, what I think you're asking about is I'm about to turn into begging. Well, would you please port Spider-Man to PC? And Spider-Man's published by Sony Interactive Entertainment. And as such, it's not coming to PC. It's exclusive to PlayStation. Can yeah. I poke this guy with the stick? You, well, you have to poke him four times to so poke him in each eye once. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, look at him. You look at the guy that came with It's him. not. Oh, you can't look over at him. Is it? Is it bummed out that your girlfriend likes Gears of War though? Like, shouldn't you be a Resistance fan? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, yes. really. Whatever, it's fine. I I think I cut Boomer streams off at the pass. He's like, I was gonna do that. Don't you worry. Like guilty. Release your VR games on PSVR too. Sorry, that's not happening either. <laughs> they are published by Oculus. Therefore, those games yeah. are exclusive to the Oculus That's literally store. like telling Angelina Jolie to give her baby back to wherever she took it from. Remaster, I don't know. <laughs> they haven't even announced the new All-Stars Battle Royale, have they? adopted a bunch of kids from oh, yeah. like foreign countries. But, oh, that's true. But is it? Oh, okay. It's like she's not giving them back their hers. Right. I was just imagining, is, aren't those... This in the publisher like the if the countries. parents it's like the if the publisher. parents came yeah. back and they were like hey like we got ourselves out of poverty <laughs> like we can have the baby now she's like it's mine get away from me I like how we never reached the 22 minute part of this no no we haven't I don't think we got very far no. can I just like crap, crap, can punch the guy no alright well we'll be back on Friday uh yeah. and then next week's like our last full week of streaming for a long time because we Go were ahead. tearing down the studio the, oh, I had Transition. to tell you about. I had to tell you. Yeah, you have Transition. to log in on the computer with your account. Mm. Okay. Yeah, I'll. Oh, uh, sorry. I think it's pulling them from the network. Right. I like how 8-Bit Butts is asking about no, Sunset Overdrive Three. What happened they to Sunset be. Overdrive Two? 8-Bit Butts. Do I know something? I don't know anything. Sony doesn't tell me nothing. <clears throat> uh. Let's see. What does the future hold? I don't know. The future is now the past. 
When you asked that question, our response was in the future, now it's in the past. Yep. The future holds a ton. Oh, Anastasia, have fun getting high. <laughs> Good luck with your cookies. Oh, she's doing edibles. <laughs> oh, jeez. I don't even know how old Anastasia is. What if she's like 14 or something? <laughs> I don't know. I just thought it was a funny joke. It is legal in California. That's all I'm saying. This Anastasia, a, good luck with your cookies. This is a legal comment James is making. This is legal. Yeah. <laughs> well, she said time to bake. I was just like, oh, all right. Uh, that's it for now. Uh, we'll be back Friday, 1.30. We'll stream something. Maybe Hitman. That'd Ooh. be fun. Cool. I meant to bring it, or maybe we play Resonance of High Rule, mm-hmm. but or Cadence of High Rule. That's I think it's called Cadence of High Rule. But the hard part is you have to hear the music and do stuff to the beat, and it's kind of hard because you have to keep it kind of turned down. So, ah. all right, that's all. Bye.